two back at y'all with another video. I got something that every Scat Pack owner or a Hellcat owner needs for their car. But before we get started, right, and I give you a cold start, look at this. Piece of bird shit. I parked my car right where there's no like trees or anything, and I still get bird shit on my car. Say what's up to him. What's up, y'all? Let me give y'all a quick cold start. I know y'all see that. I don't know what the hell that could be for. Every time I start my car up, it, it starts up and then it shuts right off. I don't know why. But I guess that's why my check engine light is on. But I gotta get a scanner and scan that shit because this ain't cool. This ain't cool at all. But we're gonna move on to the video. Copyright. We're gonna move on to the video. <laughs> <laughs> I got a um I got a simple install of the pro clip. Alright. I got the pro clip right here. Um in case you don't know, when you drive these cars, there's nowhere for you to put your phone. Like look. There's nowhere for you to put your phone. It slides around. I put it between my legs, it slides around, falls over. And if you got this car, then you know that seats if it, anything get in between these seats it's a wrap like you got it you might as well stop get out the car move the seats all the way forward and get it because it's impossible to get it back so right now I'm gonna show y'all a little simple install with this pro clip and I'm gonna let y'all see how it is you know with me riding around in it you know so y'all stay tuned alright so this the pro clip alright to me, this is like the best thing for your cell phone as far as, you know, Mopar owners. As far as, um, they have other things on the website. You can put a clip right down in here. And it just holds your phone, you know, like, like this. Your phone will be sitting like that. Which don't look too bad, though. I you know, probably should have gotten that. What you think? Let's get his grapes first. Yeah. It's kind of too late anyway, so. All right. Um. Open this up. Directions. All right. Looks like it's supposed to sit. The little piece is supposed to sit like this. In between here. And then this piece right here. Looks it like this. Pretty sturdy. It right? looks sturdy. Yeah. It looks sturdy, yeah, right? Yeah, very sturdy. Yeah, it ain't going nowhere. So. That's number one. Moving right along here. Make sure you go to proclip.com or go to their Instagram page and tell them that Big Jordan sent you, all right? Second piece is right here. So this is gonna be um, mounted right here. All right, that's gonna be mounted right there. Phone's gonna be able to like swivel around a little bit. These screws come with it, all right? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this off, right? And I'm gonna take this right here, and this goes to it like, just like that, all right? First thing I gotta do, in order to properly mount this piece to here, I gotta take this clip off, right? I gotta take this one clip up here off and one on the bottom. So that's what I'm gonna do first. So as you guys can see, I'm just taking this, I'm just taking this screwdriver out, all right? Take 
this piece off now so I can take this whole thing off. So I'm gonna take this off. That's a lot of work. Yeah. It's a lot of fucking work. I see. Man, fucking work. All right, so that's off. Now, the, now that that's off, I got this piece right here. I'm gonna mount it like that with those four screws. So you guys, when you mount it, gotta go um, vertically. Alright, so I got all these mounted, right? Now I gotta put all this back together. Oh shit. Okay. So this piece right here, right? This piece right here goes right back on here. Boom. Alright, we are back on. And then you just gotta remember how you took it off. Or if you want, go look at the directions, but I'm too impatient for that. <laughs> that goes right back in here. Boom. All right. So that's in there. Maybe I should loosen it a little bit. You don't want to tighten it too much. You just want it to be snug, all right? So, so it has some range has of motion. Some, yeah, it has some range of motion, yeah. Yeah. All right, that's better. All right, so the next thing to get this all together, you had the front plate, right? You wanna turn it around, right? And get all this together. Slide that piece right there. Then you wanna slide that right there. Put this circle piece right here, just like that, one. Then you take this piece, slap it down right on that groove, two. Then you put this piece right back in there. Three. Then come around, stick it through. All right, stick it through and um, give it a little tightening. Just like that. seven iPhone um, 7 plus right so you know just expand it fits perfectly boom there you go right so right there and you gotta worry about having it falling over or anything or sliding in between these seats and that's annoying as you guys can see the pro clip holds up very well i mean uh look at it it's not going nowhere phone ain't going nowhere all right only thing about the pro clip is that you do got to definitely squeeze it to make sure that your phone stays held up because there's nothing underneath here that holds your phone. That's the only thing about the Pro Clip that I don't like, but other than that, the Pro Clip does what it's supposed to do. See, I'm taking these turns, it ain't going nowhere. 
So yeah, as you guys seen, you guys see me install the pro clip. Um, it wasn't hard, you know. It's a bit tedious, all right. It's a bit tedious, but all in all, you could do it. I went without looking at the directions because it looked. I just took it apart, you know. It looked pretty straightforward, but uh, I made a minor mistake. All I did was turn the back plate around, and everything fit together. So it's definitely not hard, all right. Um, if you have a pro clip for the Hellcat Charger or Challenger or Mopar pair, because it's all the same, you know, I hope you guys seen this video and, you know, I hope that this video really helps you guys with the installment of your own pro clip. So, yo, that's the video. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. I need 100 likes, man. If you on this video, right, just give it a like, all right? If you're not, a, if you're not subscribed, shame on you. Run those likes, run those comments. Run that subscribe button, all right? I'm out, and I'll see you on the next video. I know I said the video was over, but just something that I got to show y'all with this whole pro clip thing. And here's my issue with the pro clip. You see, I got the phone sitting right here, right? But as I'm driving, going over bumps, it just falls right out. There's nothing underneath here that holds the phone, if you know what I'm saying. Like, So when I'm going over a bump, it just does this. You know, it slides down and everything, and it just comes right out. So I literally have to put it on there, squeeze it, you know, and then give it like, give it like 20 minutes of going over bumps and everything. And the thing, the phone will slide out. Um, I know that um, ProClip does have another cell phone holder there where it has the USB part connected to it. So maybe it looks like that your phone could rest on the USB portion to keep it from falling out. but. That's one thing that I don't like about the Pro Clip is that it's not all that. It don't really secure the phone like I thought it would, you know, like I see on YouTube. Maybe other people have um, issues on YouTube as well. They just don't show, but I'm going to show you guys that, you know, I'm having issues with it. So if you're watching this video, comment below. What should I do? All right. If you're having the same issue, comment below and let me know so I know I'm not the only one. All right. Now the video is over. I'll see you on the next one.